breathing out here. We are gonna freeze. Hello, hello, D Rock here. Welcome to the channel. Jen is with me. And it's a nice, cold, mid February day. A bit breezy, wouldn't you say, Jen? Yeah. I love it when the wind house, especially when it's a cold wind. It's perfect. Anyway, uh, we're in the Beaver Dam Mountains and we're going to attempt a loop on the motos, as you see here. Yep. Uh, up through Hellhole Pass, down to the desert, then back around to the truck here. I think we're going to encounter some snow. We had a storm blow in last night. I don't know how much precipitation it got up on the pass there, but there's a good chance there's going to be some. So, so yeah, let's get to it, eh, Jen? All right, let's roll. Join us. And if you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. It really helps us out. Jim, it's getting a little cold up here, huh? Yeah, no. Yeah. Right over there. Oh, yeah. All right, so I think we're almost to the pass, so keep moving. Alright, we're at the pass, so if you were to continue that way, it'll take you up to West Mountain Peak. That's a fun road. We're not doing that. It's probably completely coated in snow right now, but views from the pass are pretty cool. Now we're gonna head down. What already looks like Something interesting, huh, Jen? <laughs> you stoked or what? <laughs> Looks like there's a bit of snow down there. That should be, uh, yeah. Should be interesting, to say the least. All right, down we go into the snow. See what happens.
back down. Ready? Thank you. Yeah. You want me to hold it so you can get on the other side? Yeah, you got it. Yeah. Woo. Good one. Rocks made me coming down on them. Laid the bike down. I was say, this is getting kind of interesting. Right up there, you can see. Well, I don't know if you can see, but uh, the towers are that's the West Mountain Peak right there. So, we might be out of that uh, really steep, loose stuff now and back on a decent dirt road. I'm not sure, but the snow's thinned out, so uh, that was definitely interesting. Oh, yeah. All right. Hopefully, we are out of the snow as we continue to head down.
is one of the main roads we're heading back on. I am not really disappointed to be on a major road. <laughs> I gotta say. Uh, I think our nerves were a little shot on that last one, eh? <laughs> Coming down out of the mountain. I just wasn't expecting it, you know? Skill builder, I suppose, but I don't know. Skill builder, character builder. Uh, yeah, I guess so. Well, it's my turn to lay the bike down. Yeah. How did that happen? Uh, I was coming down and all those big rocks were loose and my wheel turned a little bit and that was it. Get back over. I had the camera up when I did it too. So, yeah, well. Dang it. Anyway, but uh, back on a pretty decent dirt road and Beaver Dam Wash out here with Moapa Peak out in the distance somewhere out there with my finger. I can't really see the goggles. We're gonna head back down the road here and uh, connect and hopefully uh, get back to the main road. Oh, we saw this. cave here and that's pretty cool all that black stuff in there is from fire so people who used to chill in here and have fires native cowboy or whatever he's pretty cool from it too huh Well, I'm glad the wind's let up. <laughs> so we're taking a break. Grab something to eat. And, uh, you know the story. So, once again, it's like some of the other videos. We brought bags. I brought stuff in case I get to... Uh, bike breaks down or something like that and I gotta walk out of here so I got what I need to do it. Jen's got one on the back of the bike too so you know trying to stay on top of things. What do you got there? Peanut butter. Oh wow. I got bologna in here somewhere. Nice. Well cheers folks. How's your sandwich? Pretty good at that nerve-wracking descent out of the mountains there. Well, we came down and just when I thought we were out of some of the intensity, we hit Indian Springs. <laughs> A little tight in there with some, uh, some larger rocks and water and all kinds of cool stuff. Walking it down. <laughs> yeah, I was, wasn't expecting that. <laughs> and in case you're wondering, I'm riding a Yamaha XT250 here, and Jin's rocking 
the Yamaha TW200. And they've done pretty darn good today, wouldn't you say? Yeah. Yes, they have. It's a cold wind, Jen. Man, numbing. When we started this morning, it was 40 degrees. Considerably colder once we got up in the mountains, of course, but uh, and the wind is not helping. It is howling. All right, can we finish this out? Yeah, let's get rolling. All right, well, we're back to the road. Head back that way a bit, and we'll be right back to the truck, and that'll be the loop. Pretty cool, huh? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Nice. Well, we made it back. That was just once we left the dirt. It was only like a five minute ride back to the truck from just down here. So I checked the stats because I tracked us, and that loop was 25 miles. Not, that's not, not much. But boy, it had some interesting, <laughs> had some terrain in there. Yeah, yeah. And going up, it was pretty chill, but once we headed down from Hellhole Pass, man, it got interesting really quick, especially with a bunch of the snow tossed in. I'm glad we went that way. I don't think I could go the other way. Yeah, I'm yeah. glad we went that way, headed back east and then up and over instead of starting and heading that way. Yeah, that would have Going up, it would have been pretty gnarly, man. Anyway, there you have it, Hellhole Pass Loop, Beaver Dam Mountains. As always, thank you very much for watching. Stay safe out there. If you haven't subscribed, please consider doing so. A lot more to come, folks, so stick with us. We'll see you next time. D-Rock out. Turn out. Adios.